Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Creeper World 4. That is right, we are back heading into the colony section yet again for another Neocursor map. That's right, it's Neocursor 5 Triplet. Oh my, whoa, there's three Orbeez now? I sure wonder where this is going. Uh, try using half of them for defense and half for offense. If the math doesn't work out, cut one in half. Well, that makes perfect sense. Um, by the way, I'm messing around, I'm messing around. Uh, around with these so uh maybe on this if this one's bad just tell me uh we will indeed drink it although i am loving these maps i love the orb idea and now that we have multiples oh, so very cool uh there are a total of three orbs available this is starting to create a lot of questions where do they come from why are there so many why are there supporting structures on the ground which the creeper cannot damage why do not worry for these questions are not important I know just that. Uh, I know that those three orbs will all listen to their own key. That's right. This time the keys are Y, U, and I. The Y key is normally bound to disarming a unit. Don't worry, there's no units to disarm anyway. <laughs> Did not know that. Good to know. Good to know. I'm sure we can use these three orbs to beam down Anti Creeper in any spot we may require. The victory is only a matter of time. You rock! Let's go! We can do this! Let's prove the Beam Cursor cur cur orbs are worthy of their existence. If they don't, if you don't stop soon, we'll have to stop your efforts in their tracks. This method is proving too efficient in thwarting our plans, yet it's filled with many weak spots. We will not be deterred. Who was that? Oh well. I'm sure it's no big deal, right? Okay, so we're getting A, more lore, B, more orbs, and C, more creep. Oh my, oh my. So what do we have? We have a bunch of, bunch of power towers. Now, a lot are tied to uh, spots of breeder, so we do have to be worried about that. So there's a breeder over here, breeder over there, breeder all around. Um, we have three orbs, it looks like. Uh, we have a lot of spots that may be kind of safe. Like, this is kind of safe. It is connected to some breeder, but it's kind of out of the way. That might be a good early one to get to. This, probably not. This, probably good power. And uh, its own island. Same thing over here. While there is a lot of breeder there, we can probably take that relatively easily. A tiny bit of breeder here, so we can probably take that one very easily. This is very close to that, so I'm a little worried about that one, but I'd like to take it, you know, just try and get some more power. Our goal is to get as much power as possible, and I think we're going to start with just some easy bits of power. So something like this, something like that, something like that. Grab some of those, go for like our main island as well. Anything that's an island, also very good power. So let's, uh, let's get going. Uh, we have Y, U, and I, so let's unpause, toss down like Y you and I over here, try and get up there, if we can, we can, bazinga, put one over there, uh, Y and U over there, I is taking that, boom, we already got our first bit of power, uh, we are going to be moving around relatively quickly, hopefully, because <laughs> the creep will not wait, so there we go, we're going for another bit of power, look at that, two down, a few to go, and oh, is that a dry spot, it is, the more dry spots, the better, because a dry spot means we can just make creep on it, or AC on it, and that's, boom, another bit of power. We're just collecting some power right now, trying to expand our general modifiers. So, yeah, once we once we take plenty of these things, uh, we're going to... Oh, I'm already making an assault onto this. And I think, because of all of our bonus power, we are able to do it. Uh, we're going to move a second one up here. Yeah, it's, it's going, and we're going to get another bonus power. Holy, oh, and that's already taken. Uh, we can move this over here, try and uh, alleviate some stress. And yeah, so far so far we're holding. Uh, this is probably going to need some reinforcement. This will probably need some reinforcement soon. Uh, this is looking pretty okay, but let's let's go over to this side. Uh, I, ooh, you know what, maybe, maybe it was a little too quick over there, but let's get over here, grab this island, and we also need our main island, so we'll get our main island back as well, I kind of let that go, but, you know, we took a lot of very easy powers, so I'm pretty okay with that, there we go, this will drain that away, again, this is holding, this is holding, you can start working on the main island, because that corner has been taken. So let's get our main island on and try and, again, get some more beautiful, beautiful power for us. Let's see. Let's take a little pause and see how we're looking in terms of size of creep. See, there's a lot of... This is just an island. I don't even... Oh, that is kind of connected. So we will have to take out this. We're going to have to take out this corner. And then I think this will be relatively... Ooh, this is drying up. So I think we can probably take this power as well. 
So we have to hold this, hold this, hold this, and then probably take out this corner. If we take out this corner while holding these three, I think that's going to be really good for us. We want to take this island completely, so that shouldn't be too hard with all three here. So we can take this out very, very quickly. And then I think we take this and this corner, and then we expand out from there. Like, we go for this one after that with all of our power, and then we'll reassess from there. So that is sort of the moving plan as it is right now. Uh, so I, I'm pretty happy with that. This this island should be relatively quickly. I mean, this is our first island, so, you know, I mean, we're all... I mean, look at it. We're already destroying it. Uh, we do want some more defense over here. We're going to get a little defense over there, and we're going to put one over here. So, which one is left? You are Y. Y, get over there. Get that corner, because that corner is a breeder, and I don't want it. I don't want it! No, no, no. Uh, you are you. <laughs> There we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Just what we wanted to see. And, yeah, now we can start working on maybe... Ooh, I never actually took that. So let's uh, let's just fully take this island. Uh, take that extra juice. How are we? We're up to 95. That is not too shabby, if you ask me. And if we can, if we can really get everything here, push into this probably. Feels like a pretty good spot. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. And I think we can just take this corner. And if we take this corner, it's just going to be good for business. Again, it looks like this is the main thing pushing out into this. So that... Oh, no. Don't, don't let that go, though. Uh, what do we have? We have an I and a Y. Let's move Y on over. Oh, no. The U is in the middle. That kind of sucks. But that's okay. U has taken back that. Ooh, but this is... This is actually going not as well as I would like to see. So I guess we're going to lose this 10. That's okay, because I'd rather eliminate a source of creep, right? If we can just use that to eliminate this, then more assault, more good, more pressure, and we don't have to worry about things as much. So, yeah, I really like that, because that now just eliminates this. And I think that basically means this is safe, which is grand. This is... Uh, problematic, but that's okay. Uh, this is holding on, which I'm actually really surprised and thrilled about. Uh, so let's uh, toss down two down there, uh, push in here, and then we can just take out this entirely again. That way, this whole area, this whole corner is now safe. Safe, 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 safe. Uh, we'll put one in defensive mode, you know. A they're they're going to activate my trap card kind of thing, you know. That's, that's what it's all about. Uh, protecting, protecting, and there we go. That is now safe. Move them to defense over here. Move this to a little bit of offense, and let's reassess. Ooh, this got taken back, but how bad is it? See, this is still not bad. We can probably take that back and hold it with minimal effort. This is getting assaulted, though. <laughs> this is going to be a tricky one. So what we want to do is hold this for a little bit, hold this for a little bit, take this. So I'm going to use I. So U is this. Y is this, I is going to be this. Okay, so let's uh, let's do that. Let's move Ion over here. Ion! I like it. Um, move that uh, over to this side. Take this back, which will be good. And then we're going to try and assault the big one, right? We want to really, really, really get this uh, this going. Because this is the big breeder on this side of the map. So if we can, like, push into it. Uh, I think that's going to be just the mega win, right? Because we push into that, then we just sort of hold this area. Again, it's all about holding our areas. So we have to. The assault is beginning. It is... Our assault is pretty strong, because we, we've gotten a couple of orbs to our... Or, you know, points of power on our side. So I'm holding this here, and we're going to use that very, very soon. Why? You are coming with us very soon. But for now, I'm just using the initial two to sort of cut this off, uh, drain some of the big swamp there. I mean, that is... Oh, it's so beautiful when it drains like that. You gotta love it. Um, and let's get Y in here, right? Because Y will be the big one that can start pushing while those two are kind of holding. And our goal is just to get our butt into this breeder terrain. Now, it's breeding right now, which is perfect, because now the breeding cycle is over. So we should be able to do some real damage with all three here. Hopefully we can take out like a third of it. If we can take out like a third, I think that'll be pretty substantial. 
Uh, looks like we're, we're making pretty good progress. It, it's not necessarily draining, uh, but we are... We are taking out a large chunk of it. I'd say that's almost a third. It is going to be breeding any second now. Uh, but as long as we can hold it from taking over, I think we got this. I think we got it. Because now it's breeding. There's even less in here now. So, yeah. I, you, Y. Just push it in. Get it closed. Oh, yeah. Get it to the end. Oh, that's so, so good to see. Oh, that was not active. It is now active. Everything. And we've uh, we've taken out one of the big breeding spots. And, you know, we did lose this, but we just lost it, right? And by just losing it there, we can we can we can reclaim, right? We can also reclaim this one as well. Fantastic. And I think with this, we can now go for this spot. Because, again, this spot is probably the big spot that's feeding this side. Uh, I mean, that's that's the giant spot. But they have really thin paths to take. And thin paths suck. I mean, <laughs> thin paths suck. So if we can sort of take this out, I think... I think we got something really good on our hands. So again, we're gonna we're gonna do a little bit of a salt formation, try and get on land over here. Looking pretty good. And yeah, we just cut that off, which should now basically mean this is safe. Again, we're just trying to, to make things safe for our, our friendly, friendly towers. And this is actually much safer because now it's not gonna creep in from the backside. And yeah, it's breeding now, which is actually no, it's breeding in a second. No, but we're, we're cutting it off already. I mean, look at that. Uh, we're starting to get in. Our, our little pillars are doing good. And look at that drainage. Oh, it feels so good. It feels so good, you know. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy with uh, how this went uh, so far. <laughs> we still have some pretty big ones. That's going to be a problem. Uh, and we're going to work on some other areas, of course. Uh, I don't think we're going to go for the big, big one yet. How powerful is that? That's a 10. That's a 5. That's 25. I definitely want that. And that's a 5. So, yeah, 5. Not super strong, comparatively. Uh, but there we go. Now this area is ours. So, for instance, if we just do a little bit here, a little bit here, a little bit here. Uh, this pushes this back. We're good. This has to fill this entire basin now, which is even better. And, yeah, we're, we're, we're pretty safe. I am pretty content with that. We are doing the next assault. And I guess it's going to be down here. Oh, that's a fiver. That's a that's a fiver. That's 25, but I want to take out some of the breeders, right? I mean, let's let's pause. Let's see. Yes, that's really big. Uh, that's actually not that that's not that thick. Oh, okay. It's it's okay. <laughs> that's really deep over on this side. I wasn't looking properly. That was my fault. That's pretty deep. Okay. So that is very deep on its side. Uh, all of these are pretty deep. We do have most of the power that we can get on the map, though, minus in the super deep areas. And again, look, like, nothing can touch this other than that. And this has to fill up that. So we're super safe right now. So the question is... I think this will be easier to get to, but harder to take. While this will be easier to take, but that's a little bit harder to get to, because it's a little bit further in. I do think we're going to start on this side, because... We could start, like, right here and just work our way in. That would be a good holding point. But I don't necessarily want holding points. But that is a... That's a fiver. With this fiver, we could then... Yeah, okay, we're doing that. I talked myself into it. So why you and I get your butts over here. Start pushing in. That's right. Bazing, bazang, bazunga. The triple threat trio, uh, as they are called. And, yeah, we're moving straight in. And look at this. We might even be able to prevent this from mostly breeding in this next cycle. So that's... That's actually pretty pretty substantial for us. You know, not only are we taking land, but we took most of one of their three breeding zones on this big island set. So, yeah, I, I like the thought of that. So, and we're super close to this minus five. I mean, it's not much. Maybe we'll leave one at this minus ten. It might not be the most important thing, but if we can, if we can just sort of hold this for a minute... I mean, that's that's another minus 10. So let's just see what we can do here. Maybe give it a little bit of support. Uh, see how far back we can push. And maybe this will this will hold for a little bit. You know? You never know. Um, oh, look at that. That's actually filled in with our own goo. Oh, love it. Uh, that's, uh, that's perfectly fine, though. Uh, so, yeah. Pushing on in. Taking more land. 
push this in. Again, this, this right here is just here, just as a little bit of a buffer before we go on the full assault, of course. And that's what we're doing now, full assault. So we'll move one there, we'll move one there, we'll move one there, try and assault from all directions. Lovely. Let's see how fast this gets taken. Yeah, so that's getting taken back relatively quickly. So I don't know if it's really worth it. Um, but what is worth it is this breeding cycle is over. And with this breeding cycle being over, that means this has nowhere to go but dead. Dead creeper zone. Oh my. See, that's actually holding. I think it's, that is much higher up than the other land masses. So that's actually pretty viable. You know, it's not like the best or easiest thing to hold, but it's given us, given us a nice little power boost for a fair bit of time. So I think we're going to try and do that from time to time where we just take that uh hold it you know maybe toss one once this is done uh just back like that we have a nice little defensive point we've taken this i want to take this i do want the big power boost you know the the 25 there uh but i think if we get rid of the breeder that's just going to be the biggest impact right we take out the breeder then there's nothing coming for us feels pretty good in the long run See, this is this is just working, pushing it back, and I, if you can get on the land, which I think we have, if we can just get all three right here, oh yeah, look at that, I mean, <laughs> oop, where are we, we're over here, we got the pillar of goo, oh, such, such good, uh, and yeah, we're moving straight into this, right, we move straight into this, hopefully this has enough, uh, foam in it just to last a little while while we take out this breeder and if it does and we take out this side then all that's left is just to clean up this which is has no support you know when uh when creeper goes unsupported it is not fun for the creeper uh and yeah our, our beams are cleaving into them so i'm i'm pretty happy with that we oh we still haven't lost that Whew, i was afraid oh but we did lose that so let's that should be a super quick take again just just something like that uh, ooh, we are, we are fighting the breeding cycle. Unfortunate, unfortunate, but we gained, gained some power right there. So let's move them back with their added power. The breeding cycle has ended. Uh, unfortunately it was a lot of creep that was bred. <laughs> That's why I definitely want to take this out. Uh, cause once we, again, once we get rid of the, uh, the breeder, I mean, look, see, there's so much less creep here now than there once was. Cause a, it's not breeding and B we're killing it. You know, we're, we are quite a lot killing it. That's safe, um, which is grand. And, oh, that got taken back. You know what? I'm not going to worry about that one for now. I'm just going to hold them here with their current power. Hold off against the breeding cycle. Our goal is to now just take a bit more, right? We're going to leave one there, move one over, move one over. The breeding cycle, oh, the breeding cycle actually didn't end. So that's perfect. We're almost done. We're almost there. So if we move you over, the breeding cycle is happening. But look at how little breeding area they have, right? Not that much at all. Oop. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I want to zoom in. Not that much at all. No more breeding for this land. So, yeah. I think we're good. How is this looking? See? This actually held. So that's amazing times two. That's still ours. Amazing times three. So yeah, all we need to do is now just push this out, and then and then we're done. We've taken a large chunk of land, and we've taken our next three power modifiers. Oh my, oh my. So you can finish off over there. Push in over here. Let's just make sure they can't breed. Uh, I think that should just die on its own. Yeah, that's definitely going to just die on its own. Give us that power modifier as soon as possible. And, yeah, I guess what we're going to do is we want this 25-er as soon as possible now. Probably could have done this first and made this sort of like this, where it's kind of holding. Uh, but you know what? You know, that's for that's for thinking me. This is, this, is, uh, <laughs> this is just going me. Again, I'm trying not to pause too many times. I have paused a couple, uh, especially more than I was planning on doing. So... It is, it is definitely relatively difficult with uh, with three under your control. So, but look at that. See, this land is... Oh, no, 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 no. Not when it's about to breed. I was surprised. I'm super surprised that it uh, flowed in that much. But that's okay. Look at that. We were able to, to actually maintain. 
I'm gonna keep one over here just to keep that draining. <laughs> and I guess we need two over on the side to prevent this from coming back. Uh, but one over here is just gonna drain this area out and that's what we wanna see. We want this area to be drained more than anything else. <laughs> As we can see, there's not that much there. I mean, there's a good amount there, don't get me wrong. But there really isn't that much. So let's move these forward. <clears throat> you know, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Uh, did we... Okay, that's still ours. Good, 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 good. Uh, and there we go. This is this is going down. <clears throat> that's what we wanted to see. Get that down there. You're not coming back. Beautiful. Get these three over here. You're not coming in. Move them up. Move them up. Get to this point of power. <clears throat> Oddly enough, the lower these beams are in terms of uh, height, the better, the more effective they are. So I'm super happy with that. The, like, when we can get to the low ground, look at how much more it's pushing back, right? Uh, so, yeah, gotta love that. And there is our modifier. It's coming in. Active. That's what we wanted to see. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I guess all that's left is the big zone. So... I'll clear this up just so we know it's not coming back. Uh, we'll do a little bit there, just so we know we're, we're really fighting that. And I guess we're going straight back for our point of power, right? Uh, we grab this, so we're fully juiced up. I think that is every point of power on the map. Very happy for that. And I guess, yeah, I guess we're just going to start with uh, initially an assault on this. Uh, and as we can see, I mean, <laughs> yeah, look at how much we're making. Now, we are... Pr we are super producing, uh, and yeah, we're going straight on in. Let's let's watch it drain a little bit. Oh, oh yeah, that's what you want to see. Just just look at the AC. I mean, look at the AC pushing. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Uh, just move all three out. And we can take another look. <coughs> just the drainage. Uh, I believe the best term that I've heard is it's just like a souffle collapsing, right? You can just see. Just just imagine it. Oh, it's gorgeous. Uh, and again, we want to spread them out again. You know, now we're sort of making the flying V at this point. But the AC is just so strong, right? Here's the breeding cycle. So they are pushing against us, and they just can't handle it. They just can't handle it. Our beams are still fully charged, fully powerful, and it's just dropping them like they're nothing. Um, we do want to push to the wall, of course. You know, push into the wall. Always, always a good thing. So we're trying to cut it off, uh, but you know, actually... I mean, wait, we can just cut this off. I mean, there's so much we can cut off. That's the problem right now. We're doing we're doing so good. But what do we do? How do we cut this off? So we have officially kind of taken the middle, which is honestly the worst way to do it. Uh, I mean, we are keeping all of our power nodes active, so that's actually pretty good. But we want to take over the sides more than the middle, right? Uh, because once we take the sides, then we can take the middle entirely and push towards the last side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep I here. I is on lookout, and the other two are going to be on this side. Because it's right here. It's a, also a wall. That's why I don't want that side first, because, uh, you know, you kind of love your walls. Uh, so we're going to keep the other two on this side. See the green beams. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's so little creep over here now compared to what there once was. It's amazing. It's amazing. And, yeah, there, there we have it. We have pushed them off of this which basically means that this is now ours. And look at this. We can even now start taking the fight to the center again. Like, we were taking the center super easily before, and now we're just going to own the center because nothing is coming from this side of the map. So one, two, and three. I'm just making sure. Now this is why you and I are making sure they're in the right position so I know what I'm doing. Uh, definitely, again, it's, it's a brain gymnastics with all three. Uh, and moving them around when I had uh, you you left behind and I have to hit the the side ones. It's a, whew, a bit of a, a bit of a problem for my my little pea brain. But there we go, center completed, and all that's left is gonna be this final bit of cleanup. Which don't get me wrong, there will definitely be some, and it will take some time. But we're gonna we're gonna use space. We're gonna use space. You know, cut it off, fill it from all directions. The real key is that there's no more breeding. So, breeding is completed. So I guess what we're gonna do is toss one over here, just real quick, clean that up. Toss one over here, clean that up nice and easy. And then I'm gonna toss like one here, one here, and one for the, 
right like that, right? See, this is just cutting it off right in the center, right in the center. That's kind of how you want to do it. You know, we can we can even cut them off in the center here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, keep that going, keep that going. Surround this, I think. I think this might be the end of it. I don't know where there is any other creep other than right there. So that... Ooh, get over there, get over there, get over there. Should be it. That is it! Oh, whew, I was afraid I missed something somewhere. We have done it. Ooh, is that active or is that in? Okay, that it is active when it is not covered. I was a little paranoid. I was like, holy crap, was that inactive because it wasn't uh, covered? But apparently it was fine. Apparently it was fine. We're good. Let's take a look at our creep filling the map. I mean, look at this. This can, this can have so much more AC in there. Let's fill that bad boy up. Uh, let's just make sure AC is covering everything. Look, like it's so thin over there and so thin over there. I feel a little bad, but hey, that has been Neo Cursor 5 Le Triplet in, I don't know, what was that, 20 minutes and 39 seconds? Let's submit our score. How did we do? Uh, I see a lot of 30s, a cut 40, a lot of 30s. Uh, 29? Ooh, did we do really, really good? 26? I think we did really, really good. 28, yeah, I think we did really, really good. F Huzzah! Really, really good. I will take it. Big ol' wins, big gains, and yeah, we did it. Uh, looks like the top spot for Neo Cursor 5. Come and take it. I want to see you beat me play this map. It's a lot of fun. Say hi to Tricky. Tricky does read uh, comments as well. So hello, Tricky. Hope you're enjoying. Uh, thank you so much for checking out this video. Everybody, uh, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you next time. Take care.